saying he wants to go somewhere where the walls won't cave in, poor guy. So it sounds like they want this guy to stay here longer, which is concerning for me because Stayed here for 14 days. For these guys, this is shit. This is hotel quarantine. Twelve fucking clock, man up. What the fuck is the point of that? I live three hours away. Stay there. So he's supposed to be at twelve o'clock midnight. You know what? I reckon he's been here two weeks. This is out of control. This is police quarantine. This is shit. This is totally shit. Poor guy. Fucking hell. People go crazy in hotel quarantine. I relate to it big time. Fuck. You obviously know there's a guy going off his head. Listen, why is he going off his head? Is it because he's supposed to be let out and you guys haven't let him out? Can someone call me? Can a doctor call me? Because I find this really disturbing. Hi, there's a guy going off his head. You obviously know that. There's a guy going off his head upstairs, he's punching walls. Yep, can I ask why is he doing that? Is he supposed to be released from police quarantine? Yeah, but... Jeez, okay, bye. Fuck. I think he's my next door neighbor. I don't think he's having a good day. 
that I heard him say, I'll say it again, that he was supposed to be released. And this is what I get worried about. I'm supposed to be released at 11.59 on Tuesday night. And he's still here. And I reckon I'm scared that after spending 14 days here, 338 hours in one room with no air, and then they tell you you can't leave, I reckon I would go off as well. People can't understand the insanity of hotel police quarantine when you can't get any fucking air in here at all. It's madness. It's absolute madness. And you have, what do you have, seven tests in here? Like he's negative COVID. I feel for this guy. He's surrounded by police.